In a very long list of all mythical creatures across the cultures, there are many that would absolutely send a shiver down your spine. What you're about to see next is a list of the top 10 creepiest mythological monsters from around the world. Now, buckle up, because it's gonna get dark when we enter into the world of demons. Number 10. Boba, Old Hag Boba is a Bengali-origin mythical creature that derives its name from what it's infamous for. The word Boba means dumb in Bengali, and people in Bengal believe that this supernatural entity is the mythical reason for what we call sleep paralysis. It makes a person immobile in their sleep, meaning that they feel as if someone is sitting on their chest, blocking their ability to move or get up. Although scientists don't agree with this explanation, this mythical creature has been acknowledged by more than 50 cultures under different names, such as the Night Hag in Canada and the US, Ifrit in Pakistan, and Bakhtak in Persia. Many folklores also believe that the boba many times suffocates the victims to the point that they're unable to breathe and eventually die a death that is known as the Sudden Arrhythmic Death Syndrome, a term that stands for the sudden and unexpected death of adolescents and adults during their sleep. Number 9. Lou Carcal The Lou Carcal is a legendary creature from French mythology. It was described as having traits as both a serpent and a snail at the same time. It has a big and long shell on its back, similar to a snail shell, and was thought to live in underwater caves in southwest France. Its numerous lengthy, hairy, slimy-covered tentacles could reach for miles around its open jaw. These tentacles extended for a considerable distance from the cave it inhabited and laid motionless among its own viscous slime. They trap and tug everybody or anything within reach back to its cave, and then the beast would use its enormous mouth to swallow the victim entirely. The mythical beast is known to have terrorized the town of Hastings, in the southwest of France near the border with Spain, leading to the city being named Carcol. It is believed that it was last spotted in the 20th century and is now dead, but who knows? Number 8. Typhon Typhon was a huge serpentine monster who was one of Greek's mythology's scariest creatures. He was Gaia's youngest son and the god of storms and monsters. He is one of the few mythological creatures who is both god and monster. Typhon was said to be so tall that his head would often touch the stars, and his arms would span east and west. His eyes flashed fire, and he was supposed to have over a hundred serpent heads. He had twin serpents that served his legs. Zeus challenged and defeated him in the latter part of his life, and trapped him under the today active Italian volcano, Mount Etna. Number 7. Kraken the Kraken is a mythical sea monster that is claimed to live off the coastlines of Norway and Greenland. It has the impression of being the most well-known ocean-dwelling monster and has also been mentioned in numerous fictional works due to its enormous size and terrifying look. Kraken is also one of the largest, if not the largest, known mythical monsters. In 2012, scientists used deep-sea exploration devices with special lighting displays designed to attract large predators at the said coastlines and discovered a giant squid that corresponded to the physical description of the Kraken. It is infamously known for wrecking entire ships and pulling sailors to their doom. Number 6. Ghoul Ghouls are Arabic mythical monsters infamous for their consumption of human flesh. If well-fed on human flesh, they are indistinguishable from normal humans. However, their condition keeps on deteriorating for as long as they remain without human flesh. A starving ghoul will be incredibly thin and pale, with veins visible through the skin running with black blood with them and long claws. It is essential for them to consume human flesh on a regular basis in order to survive. A ghoul that refuses to eat flesh for an extended period of time will begin to feel the physical repercussions of starvation. It is believed that they can take on the characteristics and looks of anyone they have devoured. Ghoul sightings have been recorded all around the world throughout history, with the most famous one being the case of the New Louisiana Swamp Monster. Number 5. Banshee With its origin in Irish mythology, the Banshee is a female spirit-like entity that is commonly seen as a death harbinger and a messenger from the underworld. She is said to be the ghost of a young girl who was brutally murdered. This Banshee is supposed to resemble an elderly woman with decaying teeth and long fingernails. 
She's dressed in rags and has blood red eyes so full of hatred that gazing into them directly can kill the person. Similar creatures can also be found in Norse, Welsh, and American legends. Number 4. Nukalavi The Nukalavi is an Orcadian mythical beast. He has no skin, a gigantic gaping mouth, and a single giant eye that burns with a red flame. He looks like a centaur, which means a creature with just the body and legs of a horse. He is considered the nastiest of all the demons of Scotland's northern isles. The two things that he despises are running water and burning seaweed. It can enrage him to go on a killing spree, which can only be stopped by the mither of the sea. Nukalavi's most prominent sighting was in the Orkney Islands of Scotland, where people believe that he would be the root cause of any epidemic that hits the world. Number 3. Yarama Yahu Yarama Yahu is a blood-sucking creature from the Australian Aboriginal mythology that hides in the treetops until a person walks under it, then leaps from the tree onto the victim, sucks nearly all of their blood, and swallows them whole. After swallowing the victim, it would vomit the person, drink some water, and nap, then wake up and do this over and over again until the victim themselves become a Yaramayahu. It has the appearance of a small red frog-like man or woman, standing around 4 feet tall with red hair and skin and an enormous mouth with no teeth. The Yaramayahu, according to myth, is only active during the daylight and only hunts living prey. Number 2. Teke 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 is a Japanese mythological creature and an urban legend originally born as a girl named Chizo, who was tormented and raped, forced her to jump off a railway station onto the lines, where she was then split in half by an oncoming train. She managed to stay barely alive and crept to someone for assistance, but when they saw her deformities, they left her to die. Her furious soul now wanders Japan streets. She is a spiteful spirit who haunts cities and train stations late at night. As she no longer has a lower body, she travels on her hands or elbows, dragging her upper torso and making scratching sounds while she moves. If she comes across someone, she will hunt them down and slit their torsos in half, killing them in a manner that replicates her own condition. So now, I advise you to brace yourself for the final and the creepiest monster from the list. However, I'd like to warn you that its visuals are not for the faint-hearted. So only proceed if you can tackle nightmares. Number 1. Penangalon Originating from the Malay mythic beliefs, the Penangalon is a nocturnal, undead monster. During the day, the Penangalon took the appearance of a human female, reflecting its actual form from the time it was alive. While at night, it would go back to its den, split its head and body, revealing a three-foot-long tail of dangling organs and blazing red eyes that looked horrific during the night time. Its head glided around looking for victims, particularly pregnant females who were attractive and young. When the Penangalon found a suitable victim, it would hypnotize her, pierce her neck, and feed on her blood all night. It would then release the victim, returning each night to suck more blood until the victim died. Almost every Southeast Asian country has acknowledged its existence under various names. So these were the top 10 creepiest mythological monsters of all time. What do you think? Is there any other creepier monster worthy of this list? Let us know down in the comments below. And also don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Lastly, now that you've made it through the entire video, don't worry about nightmares. You'll be able to make it through tonight. After all, all these creatures are only mythical and imaginary. Or are they?